why are mystical experiences so hard to rationalize? There is a very simple explanation for that. It is that the rational brain doesn't function, uh, you know, with a full dimension, the full expression of an embodied experience. So when you're trying to bring back an experience, you know, the experience of whatness or the experience of happiness and describe that in the form of words, if you're a poet, if you are somebody who is really good with words, you might be able to kind of contain and summarize that experience and bring it back to something that can be rationalized logically understood. Under Understood. But the thing is that the mystical experience is going to be way, way vaster. It's a multidimensional experience. So when you try to bring it back into the words, you are reducing that experience to something that is much smaller than the real thing. The pathway, you know, the words that you are going to use are still going to be a pathway to bring you back to the experience. It means that somebody reading those words might have a feeling of what you experience, but basically the rational thought is going to be a reduction of a mystical experience that is much vaster.